Alright, hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and today we're going to be playing some more of the Alchemist Code. And today, there is a new event, and it's for a free unit called uh, Paradot that looks very interesting. I looked at her uh, classes, it's pretty much um, Mage, uh, Thief, and Sage, which are actually pretty nice. It's kind of like um, Fong Yu? Or... Something like that. Whichever the other dude was that had also the double magic. Because he also had a sage and mage. Hold on. I think we can find him. I don't have him, so he should be in here. There he is. Oh, that's his name. Yeah, she's pretty much just like him. Which is going to be quite nice to carry around. I wonder what the event rewards are before we actually started and get through it. So there's apparently um, three sages to it? I'll do all those later. Uh, episode 1, episode 3. Yeah, this just seems like episode 3 is the last one. Along with hard modes, that's pretty much it. So yeah, there are hard modes we have to do. So we're gonna do that through this whole video. Let's get into it. Ah, uh, let me go ahead and change my team in these settings. Just because I was farming goad. Alright, I don't think there's gonna be any story with it. Is there? Because this is like a normal free unit. Oh, there is. Flamel. <laughs> ah, I don't think I like his character very much. Man's too shy for me. For sure, other people will enjoy him. Alright, so how's this looking? Anything else over there? Just a man trick. Okay, cool. I probably should have just brung a range character too. I guess I'll switch out Zangetsu since having him and Shayna is probably overkill. I did finally get Lufia to uh, 75. And we'll use that. There we go. So the first episode isn't all that difficult. Uh, I am curious how the hard stages are going to go though. That's the only thing I question at the moment. So I can pretty much just auto this one. So that one isn't very hard. Oh, it just takes me directly out. Okay, well then, uh, next episode. Hold on. Does it drop anything here? Nope. What about here? Nope, no shards. Okay, I guess you get shards at episode 3, or the hard modes. Uh, let's go Crater. Pretty sure she's 3 or 4, right? She's 3. Paradox. I kind of like her design a little bit. A little bit. She doesn't need anything special to evolve her, right? I hate those type of characters. Oh, there she is. Alright, no. And... What can I say about her facial design? It's, it's nice, let's say that. I still hate the fact that they don't match the art 
like costume and design everything with the actual model. I think that's the only downfall that I really hate for this game. Like the cloud characters, they have their costumes and you could just switch their swords and weapons and stuff. You don't have to change like their default costume and stuff like that. But I guess they, they're trying to keep themselves from doing a lot of work. I mean, I wouldn't mind if it took longer for things to release. As long as they had, like, good costume designed on them. But that's just me. More people would probably want characters to come faster. That's just them. Alright, let's see. Oh, you're a monk? I'm pretty sure you have a... Uh, overclocked then. Uh, what do you all have? Oh, you don't have a high attack, so we're good. To be honest, I didn't even know we could do this until just now, until I saw it. I was just like, what What the hell is this? I'm pretty sure that's been in the game for, like, a long time now. Can I, like... I could. But let's use something with a little bit less. Over here. Now let's take a look at that. Uh, no, back over here. No, it doesn't tell me the difference. Well then, then that's useless. Ah, I'm just waiting for the whole stat thing to come in because I really want to see what buffs are still on me and. How much is actually doing? I just can't wait for those changes. Yeah, let's get rid of the archer. You never know if they have a stone or something. They'll just petrify your units and just be happy with that. Alright, so far, this stage is easy, so newer players shouldn't have much of a problem with it if you're actually increasing their jobs. Let's make her faster. Even though she's fast enough, but you know. No problem with her being fast- Ah. Oh. Yeah, no problem with her being faster though. Uh, that cast speed is actually pretty fast. Um, let's do toss. To stop this guy from doing whatever he's trying to do. Even though I could have used roundhouse too. Is it broken being the fastest character in the game? Yeah, it kind of is. Because you get more turns than everybody, and plus you do a crap ton of damage. Oh great, that's that wasn't mean at all. And see, it's already her turn again. That's the perk of having one of the fastest units in the game. See, I don't even regret the whole um, collab summoning of Face the Night. I regret not getting Gilgamesh, but you know, eh, this one's the next best thing. Okay, no good loot. No good rewards for that, so. 
Next. Episode 3. What do we get from here? We get that ring. All we gotta do is not use a lot of items and a lot of skills. I think we can do that. I mean, the stages have been easy so far, so... Let's get into it. Alright, what is this stage looking like? Uh, two over here. You know what, Major? I think she'll be alright on this side. Have her go here. She'll pretty much counterattack him if he does something. Use that on myself. Wait. Okay, I was checking for Flammo and just seeing if he was on the map. He's actually not. I forgot to change to a ranged character too. Everything's been going decently, I forgot to change. Take out him. I'm pretty sure his turn was up next, right? Because this one's supposed to be the healer. This guy. Yeah, we got him. I think he is casting a really annoying spell right now. Wait. Why didn't she move? Okay, whatever. What ifs? Do you do you? Ah, uh, wait. Can I? Nah, I was gonna see if I can actually go around and get him. I actually cannot. So these stages really aren't all that difficult. You guys can find them actually pretty easy. You really don't need the units I have to do it. As long as they're uh, job 11 or, or, or at least job 10 or 9, you can do this pretty easy. But job 11 characters can have no issues with this. Yeah, she doesn't do anything. Okay, well, why is she here then? <laughs> is she bugged? Because either you should be able to use her or she would move. I like the fact that she can attack from so high, too. Like, that height attack is nice. Really nice. Alright, so we got our ring. Uh, nothing else. Alright, I guess we're heading to the last piece of story. Alright. So, I guess we're done with the story? I'm guessing? Let's get into these. Uh, let's take out Ingetsu. Like, actually take him out this time. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, we're done with the story. How much damage are you guys taking now? Oh. You guys are still pretty easy. But that was a combo attack, so I don't really know. Really? I was about to say, you can't be hit right there. Alright, from here on out, we should be good. Uh, story is at the end of the video. By the way, if those of you guys who are new to the channel, I normally separate this 
like the um, actual stages for the story. So pretty much, uh, you guys will see the stage runs and the story at the end. You guys can feel free to leave the video when the story comes up. If you're just here for the stages and not my reaction to it. Wait, why don't I use it on myself? I guess that'll be fine. She's still pretty fast. Either way. I don't really have to turn to attack. Except for this guy. We have to turn to move, at least. Alright, so that one wasn't hard at all. And this stage really doesn't give me anything good, apparently. Hold on. I did forget to check this. Oh yeah, her shards do drop in hard. What drops here? Hmm. So the shards are mixed in with garbage loot. Well, I guess you wouldn't call it garbage loot, considering it does help you. The only thing I would want here are these, this, and the shield, and that's it. Everything else I really don't need. Well, actually, I do need a little bit of these, so... I guess it works out. I guess I'll farm um, Episode 2 more than anything. Unless Episode 3 has something way better. Alright, I'm curious to how these guys are going to act. Wait, that's 50? Oh, jeez. Can I still one-shot you guys? Yep. I hope she gets a job plus down the road. But I don't think she is. I mean, I could dream. <laughs> Um, actually, oh, uh, no, 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 that's not smart. Just because then they're both, at, like, target me. And I don't have faith in the evasion right now. Don't give it to yourself. Should be able to outspeed these two, or at least one of them. No, okay. Get rid of you. Okay, I think you're more important to get rid of. Got to take priorities here. Uh, actually, can he hit me right here? Yeah, he is an archer. I was thinking if I had, <laughs> if I hit right here, he wouldn't be able to hit me. But I was thinking of like gunners and all that. Wait, hold up. What was the challenges for this? I don't think I've used uh, fat skills at least. Oh, there's one shard. God, the farming for these shards are going to be annoying. Oh, actually, hold up. And now we'll end him. I'm pretty sure we can get our shards from, like, the um, event challenges, though. So it's not all that bad. We'll get most of them. 
And this is the last stage. What is all here? I can use that. Oh my god. There's... And I could probably solo this. Defeat three enemies in one blow. I know how to do that one. Because I'm pretty sure she's strong enough to do that. Alright. What is their take on mercenaries? Okay. Get no deaths, too. I'll take a second. Heal me. Alright. That should be good. You're gonna go this way. Alright, I can still pretty much one shot them. No, oh, target this one. This should be able to hit all three, right? Crap, no. Um, what about right here? There we go. Hopefully it hits all three and don't dodge. But you dare miss. Alright, there we go. Finish the challenge. See, that's why I say I like to switch out in like certain situations. Caster's not completely useless, especially since I have the, um, that Battlefield book I think we got from... Which one was it? I think it was one of the Princess events. God, there's a lot of mages here. And that's not a good thing. I'm gonna need you to tank. Ah, uh, I question this choice, but... <laughs> Let's just go ahead and do it. I'm getting really ballsy here. Really, really ballsy. with this? Yes, I can. Hopefully it does. Oh. Well then. I guess I'll just go over here and hit this guy then that's coming down the stairs. I was thinking to myself I can probably do something different. Come on. Well, I don't know if it hit both. So pretty much my, my range characters alone can do this. I really don't need to carry much else. I'm gonna try it. Oh! He tanked it. Jeez. I didn't expect that to be honest. I'll finish you off, put you out of your mirrors for you. Letter dudes back there. Can I get her from here? No. Hit him from here, but I want that chest first. No.
about to say, please break up her turn a lot faster. There we go. Perfect. And that's pretty much... I'm pretty sure that's all the stages. No, don't we have an extra dungeon? I think we do have an extra dungeon. At least I'm hoping. Or does it come, like, later? Oh no, that's it. Unless it's gonna show up here. No, that's pretty much it, guys. Well, with that said, uh... Hold on. Hold on. I did say we we're gonna try it. Just my range characters, and that's it. And we're gonna do... this. Let's see how they do. Yeah, this seems just fine. That's gonna hurt though. So we should be able to outspeed the mages too before they even do anything. So I can actually farm this with my um, gold farming team. Hopefully they do prioritize the chest as well. Even though I know they won't. So they're gonna avoid the one that's over here. The one right here. They'll grab that one, at least. Oh, whoa. He's a, he actually survived that. Well, it is Karis. Karis hitting him. So, yeah. I already know that one. Alright. Yeah, not really all that difficult to farm. Well, for me at least. Um, other players probably could have a little bit of trouble with it, but it shouldn't be like too much trouble. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next video. So then. Peace out. I actually don't have this character either, so I don't think I'm going to aim for his job plus. Well, I'll probably get his stuff just in case, but I don't think I'm going to be using him either way. Okay, so is he part of the... I guess he's part of the council. To be honest, that's what happens a lot when you go to, like, new states, countries. That's exactly how you feel.
I wonder who else is going to be in the story. Artificial spirit? Well... Wait a minute, do all Beast Tamers have artificial spirits, or just him, apparently? Oh. I'm just waiting on that one uh, job that actually summons creatures that fight by your side. Not summoner, that doesn't count, because you only use that summoning for just like one turn. It doesn't actually turn into an ally. Yeah, but for people who haven't experienced it, yeah, it's pretty new to them. <laughs> he's like, alright, he's talking to himself, time to leave. <laughs> well, if I was the bird just watching you talk to yourself, I'd leave too. God, why did it have to be Michael? Something told me that he was still here. Especially since, um... Basically, uh... What was her name? Lafia was part of the council, too. And now... Mm, she's dead. For those of you guys who were around, uh... Christmas a bit? I'm pretty sure? Somewhere around there. Which you guys won't see for a while. Unless you actually did the event. Because the event won't come back for a while. Hmm. Well, I guess he's just the mage. Not part of the council, is he? I think I missed that part. Figure out something. Wait, who's this Simone? I oh, think I think he's talking about Paradox then, even though she's technically a sage. To be honest, I did not expect that, like, voice to fit her. She, she sounded, well, she pretty much looks like she would have a deeper voice. Somewhat of a deeper voice.
Dude, he's so nervous. You can tell. Hold up, a human? I wouldn't count him as a human, to be honest. If you're not going to give hardcore evidence, then of course nobody's going to believe you at that point. Monsters coming now? Yep, got it. Wolves? And it's always wolves, man. Interesting story. Sure, he is. I've seen so many characters like uh, Flamel and Tata um, animes, and I never grow attached to them. Unless they do something that impresses me, then maybe. actually know that. That's also the first thing we're hearing of. I don't think we've ever talked about that.
I mean, you can't actually say that because there are some weird things in the world you guys live in, and most of it turned out to be true from what we've seen. I have a lot of questions, but I'm going to save them until the end, unless they're answered. She does I don't think she has the same power though. I mean you did say it was special only to you, how would she know? Okay, so it's basically, it's basically just pretty much any animal you see, you remember from your past, is what she's getting at? Is that what you're trying to turn nostalgia into? Okay, so it's, it is based on his emotions, if he's feeling uncomfortable. Starting to like him, are you? <laughs>
I don't... Wouldn't the court just... Be against that? I mean, the spirit's right, though. You did technically say it. about to say that really doesn't make you a vegan if you don't eat fish wait what <laughs> Yeah, don't don't let him cook, please. Cheese. <sighs> he seems like one of those rich people who had like maids doing stuff for him, but now those maids gone, he's just pretty much helpless. <laughs> Watch a ton of animes like that. Never gets old. <laughs> So he is a court mage, okay. Yeah, you say that, but I'm I'm pretty sure a month is not even over yet. That I can kick you out. That that one could work too.
Yeah, listen to the wise spirit. Even though we don't know what it looks like. gonna be dying this story jeez more wolves. I mean, that's still doing something, so you technically want them to do something. But, on the other hand, the wolves respond to you pretty well. <laughs> Oh yeah, see, told you the wolves want to be friends. Oh, I guess it was a normal wolf. I mean, technically, you're right right now. <laughs> well, damn. Oh, great job. Great job, buddy. I knew it was going to happen because everybody always does it. <laughs> Nobody can ever sneak away without making any noise.
man's over here trying to stealth. I'm getting a little bit of chills from this. Finally manned up. Sounded like he summoned more than just a bird and a fox. Not like he summoned a bear and a wolf. We're not going to talk about my man having an arrow in his back. <laughs> Aw. I liked a little bit of the story. Not that bad. Yeah, so we're wrapping up the story and going into the uh, hard difficulties now. I won't lie, they're kind of a cute couple, though. Back to his old self. How much you want to bet they're going to kill him off by the end of this episode? She said that you're leaving. so depressing. Stop it. Swear it's gonna get better real soon. Don't let 
anyone tell you what you should do I got a clear view We're gonna make it soon Just keep pushing through Yo, what you got to lose Yo, what you got to lose Yo, what you got to lose Just keep pushing through Cause what you got to lose